this review is for Lace Yarn Multicolor Fine Lace Line. And it's 100% cotton, it says here. 50 grams, and I will give you the information here. If you can see that there. They, I think the size is three, number three. Tells you what hook to use here um, and um, how much it weighs, how long it is, and the component, which is what it's made of, which is 100% cotton. Now, it is 100% cotton, as you can see here. And it comes in these lovely, lovely colours. There's eight in a pack, and this particular set has a pale blue, like a, a russet colour, um, a purple colour, a bit more out. You'll see them better. Ooh, that's the russet type. Mustard, like no colour. This is beautiful, look at that colour there. And there's the lilac, or the pear and mauve, or whatever you would like to call it. Then there's black. Then there's pale blue, baby blue. So the baby pink. And then there's a red. And then there's the colour I'm using at the moment, which is... I don't know, like... Um, Colour. Slightly. Anyway, I'm using the largest needles I have because I want to eventually make a like a lace shawl um, going to somebody's wedding. And I'm just going to get out those out of the way for a moment. Now, I'm using the largest needles because I want to make a lace effect but without making lace because I don't know how to make lace. I will just finish the um, this row and I will show you what it would look like. It knits very, very well considering it's not meant to be for knitting. But I saw it and I thought, well, this is going to be. It's a bit of a pain not being able to use it from the inside. I tried, but it's all looped together, so there's no chance of it um, coming out from the middle. I tried on another one as well, and it just brings out the loops and then it goes stiff as, um, because it is 100% cotton, it holds to itself. So, oh, didn't that go over there? No, that didn't go over. I'm concentrating on something else there. There we go. We just finished doing this. Excuse the tapping, it's because I've got a metal stand between me and my knitting. And it's, it's tapping on it, and usually it's, it's held by my own body. There we go, I'll show you what it looks like. It is beautiful. There we go. It, well, <laughs> not really my, as you can see, like, it's like a lace type look. And once it's going to be, it's going to be obviously bigger. This is just like a trial to see what it looks like. And this is the effect that I want because I don't want to distract from the color that I'm going to wear, which is, um, I like um, an emerald green, so I want something to, um, not to dull it down or anything, but if, if um, because I'm self-conscious of my upper arms, I want something to go around over my shoulders, but not enough so that when the weather's too hot, it's going to affect me and I'm going to have to shrug it off and then get, yeah, feel a bit uncomfortable. So this, I think, will show enough through it, but also hide some lightly so it doesn't just get used for lace you can use it for crochet and I do have some crochet needles but I don't know how to crochet I do know how to knit but with only basic so I have made a few mistakes here but this is just a trial thing to see what it would look like and there you go oh one more thing it's actually quite strong. It won't. It doesn't um, fluff either. 
you know like some cottons it fluffs and it gets bitty this actually hasn't so far as you can see